morning everybody it's a beautiful morning here in Canada just getting ready to uh, head off to work in my my smart electric drive and I thought I'd give you guys a, uh, a summer range report I have a video with my winter range and uh, a lot of people kind of been asking you know how far do you can you get in the summertime you know in better weather so today's the day I'm going to show you guys how far this thing can go. Okay, let's go over a couple of the numbers here. I've reset my tripometer, so everything is sitting at zero. As you can see, it's sitting at 14 degrees Celsius this morning. And I have a full charge on the battery. So I'll be driving at 80 kilometers an hour. I'm going to set the cruise. The AC is going to be turned off this morning because it's not very cold or hot out. And as soon as I get to work, I'll give you an update on, on my range report. Okay, I just pulled into work. Let's take a look at the battery. So it's about, uh, I used just a little over 25%. It's probably about 26, 27% battery. And if you take a look, so I averaged 16.7 uh, kilowatt hours per 100. Temperature's currently sitting at 19 and 32 kilometers. Okay, so that's the halfway mark. Um, and uh, when I leave tonight, we'll fire up the video again and I'll show you what I do going home. All right, just heading out of the office. Okay, that's it folks, we made it. So let's take a look at the numbers here. So, battery sitting just under 50%, so it's probably like 48. Yeah, let's take a look. So this time I averaged 14 and a half kilowatt hours per 100. It was 33 kilometers. So, yeah, there you have it. So overall did uh, about 65 kilometers burnt just a hair over 50 percent battery so range is a lot better in the summertime as as everyone would expect well hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, if you like it i have a couple other smart car videos uh, up on my youtube page so i uh, check those out i do a winter range report and just kind of go over some of the other things about ev cars and uh, just make sure you subscribe to my channel and uh, thanks for watching.